Inside of the country, east here of Kabul, they were gathering for a ceremony to inaugurate a new mosque. It was then that the Taliban struck, killing 23 people, including one of the most important men in the security services here. A scene of devastation after a suicide bombing right outside a mosque in Lagman province in eastern Afghanistan. The Taliban say they carried out this attack, which killed 23 people. But just one man was the target. This land cruiser, the car of the deputy director of Afghanistan's intelligence agency, Abdullah Lagmani, the most senior security official to be killed in the last eight years. Lagmani was not a high-profile public figure, but he played a key role. Only last week, at the side of the interior minister, at the scene of a bombing that killed more than 40 people in Kandahar. Politicians say his death is a setback in the fight against the Taliban. See, he was a very important person in the security uh, department of Afghanistan. He had good relation with the people in the area, not only in the uh, area, all over Afghanistan. Yeah, he's a true son of Afghan, and uh, he uh, dedicated his life for uh, serving the country. He was one of the prominent uh, figures within the security um, the circle of Afghanistan. Many were injured in the blast. They've been taken to a local hospital. This boy says, my hand, my foot, it's injured. My back is burned. On this occasion, the Taliban killed their target, but it was done with a very high cost in civilian lives. Lives lost and lives now ruined. We first started to get news here in Kabul of that massive bomb blast in Lagman province while I was attending a UN uh, new